Chris Rodinas, Research Analyst for IT Creations, here to give you an overview of Dell's PowerEdge T420 Tower Server in both the 4 and 8 bay chassis options. This server makes use of Intel's E5-2400 processor family with two available CPU sockets that use the Intel C600 chipset. Memory speeds of up to 1600 megatransfers per second are supported and up to 384 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM, which can be installed into the 12 DIMMs in sizes up to 32 gigabytes per slot. The T420 4 and 8 bay options can be powered by a single cabled 550 watt power supply. An 8 bay hot plug power supply chassis offers redundant power supplies of 495 watt, 750 watt, or 1100 watt. For storage, you can choose between either four 3.5 inch cable bays or eight 3.5 inch hot plug bays of either SATA, SAS, or SSD hard drives. For RAID controllers, cards like the Perk H310, H710, or H710P can be added or the onboard Perk S110 can be used. There are six PCIe slots in the T420, two X16 full height slots, one X8X4 Gen 3 half length, one X8X4 Gen 2 half length, one X8X4 Gen 3 full height, and one X8X1 Gen 2 full height slot. The T420 can use either one NVIDIA Quadro 6000 or two Quadro 4000 GPUs. When GPU cards are used, using 1100 watts of power is recommended. Networking cards like the Broadcom 5720 can be added for additional networking options. The T420 weighs nearly 66 pounds and measures 18 and a half inches tall, 8 and a half inches wide, and 22 and a half inches deep. On the front of the 8 base server option, we can see a power button, NMI, system LCD, two USB ports, space for three five and a quarter inch bays, and eight hot plug hard drive bays. The front of the four bay option has space for two five and a quarter inch bays and air vents for the cable drives inside. On the back of the server, there's the power supply, space for the optional iDRAC 7 Enterprise port, six USB 2.0 ports, two RJ45 ports for onboard one gigabit ethernet, VGA and serial connectors. For server management, the T420 comes standard with basic management or software licenses, which can be upgraded to enable iDRAC 7 Express. With an additional license and hardware, the full features of iDRAC 7 Enterprise can be used for greater remote management. For operating systems, this server can use Windows Server 2012, 2008, SUS, or Red Hat Linux. And for virtualization, Zen Server, VMware's vSphere, or Red Hat Virtualization. That's all for the T420. Let us know what you thought about this video in the comments below. And if there's any workstation or server that you would like us to review next, please send us an email at itcreationstv at gmail.com, as well as subscribing to our channel to stay up to date on our most recent overviews and benchmarks. I'm Chris Rodinas for IT Creations, and we'll see you next time.